There are three trends disrupting big data. The first is self-service BI. That gave business the freedom to create their own analytics, but it had unintended consequences of creating data chaos and semantic inconsistencies for the enterprise. And the second major trend was the movement to data lakes. I saw this at Yahoo eight years ago with the birth of Hadoop. That created a whole nother platform and a whole nother way of processing and storing data that was fundamentally incompatible with BI tools and analytics and analytics users. And then the third major trend is the movement to the cloud. That presents a whole host of new issues for enterprises when it comes to data locality. Now they're managing data on premise and in the cloud, as well as the fact that moving to the cloud means adopting entirely new data platforms, what we call the Data Lake 2.0, which introduces a whole nother a host of challenges that are very similar to the movement to Hadoop. So the enterprises that are successful at solving these problems treat their data as a service. And they do that by creating a universal semantic layer for the enterprise. That allows the business to self-serve with consistent and performant data. It allows their BI tools to be able to access data in any platform, whether that be in traditional relational platforms or the new data lake type platforms. And it allows them to access the data whether it's on-premise or in the cloud. We have a large automotive manufacturer who is looking to provide self-service BI to their business on a data lake. They bought AtScale to use as a universal semantic layer, which allowed them to provide access to both their Microsoft Power BI and Tableau users. We ended up reducing the time to insight from six weeks to two days. A large financial institution was looking to dramatically reduce their data platform costs. With AtScale as a universal semantic layer on Hadoop, we were able to reduce their data platform costs from $100 per gigabyte to $1.62 per gigabyte. A large North American retailer started with that scale on premise with Hadoop. They wanted to migrate their entire infrastructure to the Google Cloud. They were able to do that with that scale without disrupting any of their 3,000 users who are using Microsoft Excel with the live access to at scale to analyze their previous day's sales data. At AtScale, we make BI work for big data.